Shooting at him off. Go check the fertilizer. Oh, oh god. He's back. He's back. He's back. He's back. Okay. Okay. Come on. Come here. Come here. No. No, no, no. Come this way. Come this way. Oh god. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Welcome back to the digital universe. We are back on our Ark Survival Evolved Let's Play world here for episode number six. Guys, last episode we did some awesome adventuring. I have come up with a name for our Pteranodon here. He has been dubbed Sam the Speedster. Sam just kind of popped up out of nowhere because I thought Speedster would be a fun name because he's sort of the type of bird you go to if you need to get somewhere real quick, if you know what I mean. He's not like a fighter really. Uh, he's more of like a transport kind of guy, so I figured Speedster because he's super fast, and then, you know, like I said, Sam, whatever, SS, um, and then, you know, of course, anyway, um, okay, so last episode we did exploring, uh, here's what we got on the map so far, we are going to be finishing up exploring some episode, I don't think we're going to do that today, we had enough of exploring for a while, and I don't think the next, the, when we finish exploring, it's going to be a full episode, I figured that'd be fun because... It would be the first time that we're really leaving this cocoon here to go explore. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Um, but anyway, that is over. We have got our guy leveled up to 240. Um, and today, I was just going around doing some uh, everyday arc survival of all things, getting resources, getting chests organized. And I came to the back of the base and spotted an evildoer. Oh, I actually saw him. All right, I'm going to jump out. We spotted an evildoer back here. A Carno, level 145. The max level is 150, guys. So this is basically going to be a perfect tame if we do end up taming this guy. I figured that would be a cool thing to do this episode because we haven't had, we haven't done any tames in a little while, uh, and we haven't done a single tame with like a super strong um, guy that would easily kill me. So I hope the turrets don't fire on him. I don't know. The turrets are kind of glitchy, guys. That's another reason why this outer. Um, this outer wall is super helpful, so I hope they don't start shooting at him. Uh, but yeah, I think that we are going to try and tame this Carno this episode. He will give us a lot of needed protection. This way, if anything ever comes, we actually have a dino to fight with. Uh, and that way we, yeah, we'll be safe from anything else. And I think it'll add some, uh, some much needed excitement in our Ark Survival Evolve series. All right, so this is going to be quite a difficult tame, guys. Uh, he is super dangerous. We don't have a Quetzal that we can just stand on, and I'm not sure if I want to just stand on the base either uh, because he might run into the spikes if I'm standing up there. Um, so we've got to get a bunch of materials together. First of all, we've got a ton of narcotics. We need way more Trank Arrows. We've got 10. I'm guessing 200 is a safe number. I'm, I'm sure it won't take actually 200. It'll probably be like 100 or maybe even less. Uh, but just to be safe, I always I always bring that, and I'll probably bring an extra crossbow. So I'm going to get to crafting, uh, and as soon as I've got all the materials, we will look at what strategy we're actually going to be using to take this guy down. Okay, so I have got all of our resources here. We've got, where is it? We've got 200, like I said, 200 trank arrows up there, and we've got four stone gates and four reinforced gates. So what I'm thinking we're going to do here, our Carno is right over there behind our base. He's just chilling, 145. Uh, what I was thinking is right over here next to our base. We're right here. The base is right down there. We are right to the right of it uh, if you're facing the gate outwards. Um, what I was thinking is we can't take him on head on head, obviously. Um, and we don't have a Quetzal, like I said, so we can't just like, like get up on something. I mean, I guess we could... Maybe shoot him from there. No, because then he's going to run away, and he'll run into our base. I, I don't want any of that. Like, not into it, but it'll, he'll go into the pillars, blah, blah, blah. I don't want that. I want to trap him, uh, and that's what I'm getting to here. What I was going to say is what we can do is we can put a bunch of these, uh, what are they called, the stone gates up in a sort of square thing like this, and then we can run him out. We'll, we'll have to attract his attention. We'll have to, like, shoot him or something from afar, get him to run over to us. We'll have to run in here, and then when he comes in, we'll have to close the door, 
Maybe I'll have to put a door that's my size, so, like, we could put a door on this side that's my size, and then I'll have to run in this way and get him to come in. That way I can close the gate behind him and then run out the door that he can't get out of, and then just shoot him from maybe the doorway. Like, if the door is right here and the whole gate contraption thing is here, I'd have to shoot him from the door. So, that's not a terrible idea. Um, and the reason I want to put it here instead of right where he is is because I may as well just leave it as a sort of permanent thing. I mean, if I'm already going to waste the resources, then, you know, may as well leave it. Uh, so if I place it up here, it's not really bothering anyone. I can leave it. I didn't want to place it, like, right behind our base because that would uh, ob obstruct our nice view. Um, so, yeah, here's what I'm thinking. What we'll do is we can place it like this. Right, we gotta make it straight, or I will have a panic attack. I think that's good, right? Or maybe... Yeah, we sort of want it in the middle of this rock area. I think that's good, right there. Right? Okay, let's place that. Uh, how do I get out of this view? Okay. And then... I need these, so let's replace that for our sickle for now. Alright. So that'll be a closed one. This'll be in case we ever need dinos to come up this side. Uh, like, if we're getting them from there to trap them, we'll bring them this way. And then we'll have to connect it on this side. So, let's go into orbit camera one more time. Oh, God, that is off. Okay, does that look straight? Wow, that actually looks very straight, I think. Oh, wait, do, oh, my God, do these connect? Is that a new thing? I'm pretty sure that's connecting. I did not know that was a thing. I'll be completely honest with you. I had no clue that was a thing. All right. So we can place that there. Uh, usually I won't be getting guys from this side, obviously, because this is the cliff side. So I think I'm going to have to put... Um, can I get up? I think I'll have to put some stone walls here and then a doorway that's my size. Can Will he get trapped in here is the question. <gasps> oh, no. That's bad. He's attacking. Okay. Is that him? That's him. All right. I'm gonna go place these down and trap him real quick. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Will they snap automatically? Oh, they will. Snap. Snap! Bang. Come on. Snap. Bang. Bang. Okay, we're gonna have to lead him in here. Come on, come on, come on. Don't destroy my stuff. Please. Okay, looks like our defenses are holding up quite well, guys. Wait. Oh my god, did he get, like, killed by the spikes? He's really hurt. Um, yeah, he's getting hurt by the spikes. Okay, buddy. You know what? We'll just let him... Oh no, is he angry again? Okay. <laughs> I think he... I think he just lost in a 1v1 to spikes. Did he, or was, or were they shooting at him? I'll have to go check the fertilizer. Oh, oh god, he's back, he's back, he's back, he's back. Okay, okay, come on. Come here, come here. No, 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 come this way, come this way. Oh god! No, 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 no. Come here. He's behind us, he's behind us. Close the door. Close the door, open the door. No! Close the door! Oh my god, I can't close the door. Close on him, close on him. Stay inside. Stay. He's not inside. He's not inside. This just in. He's not inside. Okay. All right. One sec. One sec. One sec. Oh, he's behind us, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, he is. Okay. One more try. One more try. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, my God. He's right behind me. He is literally right behind me. Come on. Come in here. Come in here. Close the door. What? What is he doing? What is he doing? Where is he going? He's ru he's running away from me. Why would you possibly be running away from me? This is so weird. This is actually beyond weird. Can he just can I just get this guy to turn around, please? I I don't understand what's going on. Is he afraid of me? I shot you twice. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Stop running, stop running. Of course he had to attack the spikes. Don't you dare attack that Bronto. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Come this way. Oh my god, I can't believe you're still... 
Seriously? Okay, guys. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna speed this up real quick. I'm going to try and get this guy back in our pen. Hopefully, I can manage to do it. So, here we go. Okay, guys, and it has been done. Oh, my God. I don't know if you just saw that. He just broke my armor. I'm standing in a bush. He just broke my armor on the last hit. This was not the best design, but I, I mean, I knew that from the beginning. I was going to place, like I said, I was going to place the walls here, but I couldn't end up doing that because he was already attacking it. So I basically just had to improv it like you saw. So, wow. Oh, my God. I'm going to go heal up. I'm going to go repair my armor, and we will come back to knock this guy out. Okay, guys, we are back. Unfortunately, I'm on a budget, so we've got half the armor. Otherwise, we are half naked. Um, but I have brought us... We've got some pillars here, so let's throw these on there. What I'm thinking we can do is we will go ahead and throw these... Oh my god, did these not snap? Come on. Why would you not snap? Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna eyeball it here. We'll do, we'll do it in the corner, actually. That makes the most sense. We'll throw it, like, there, right? Then we'll go up, up, and up. Is that high enough? No, we're gonna need to go higher. Is it placing? There it is. Okay. Um, do I have a ceiling? Yes, I do have one ceiling. Okay. How are we gonna place this? Is it gonna let us place it up there? Seriously? That's the wrong button. Wait. I have to do this, like, perfectly if I get it like that. Eh. No. Okay. Um, how do I want to do this? Wait, here we go. Let's grab Sam real quick. Get over here, Sam. Okay. Let's grab Sam. You've got to be joking. I can't even move with him. What do I have on me? What do I need to throw up? Uh, okay. Let's... Throw on Tony real quick. Let's throw that. Let's throw that. Let's come over here. He's still way down. All right. I gotta throw some stuff out. One sec. All right, guys. I've got our stuff real quick. I got some stuff out of my inventory. Let's jump on Sam real quick. And let's throw our ceiling there. Thank you. Okay. And now, actually, we gotta grab our ladders. Throw them right there. Okay. We gotta be sort of careful about this. There we go. Yes. Snap the ladder. And there. Yes. Okay. We can land. And let's throw on the rest of our ladders. Bang. Bang. Can we just climb up here? Okay, there we go. Alright. So when we get up here, and there we go. We've got a nice little view right into our pen. So I'm going to speed this guy. I'm gonna speed this up, guys, real quick while I am shooting him. Uh, I actually threw out my arrows, so I gotta go down and go grab those again. But I will come back, and as soon as I get here, we will speed this up. And then I will return once we have got our Carno knocked out. And he's down. There we go, guys. We have knocked out our 145 Carno. I'm going to go grab us some narcotics, uh, and I'll see about meat, either regular raw meat or prime meat, and we'll be back when this guy is up. Three, two, one. And there we go. Our Carno has awakened, guys. We are successful. We have tamed a Carno. Let's leave him on follow. Let's bring him back to the base. The sun is just rising on our kingdom. It has just become morning, and our Carno is up. Perfect timing, actually. Um, he finished taming at level 217, which is absolutely fantastic. I believe he got 
Um, what? What is that? Like, 70-something levels? Because... Okay, I think the rest of the prime meat spoiled, but I did grab some prime meat from a stego that we killed over there. Uh, so I killed him, I grabbed some prime meat, gave it to our Carno, and that gave him, I believe it was like 99.8 like or something efficiency. So very, very good efficiency. We didn't have a problem, I just chilled here with Sam, making sure nothing came to attack our Carno, and we were good, all safe over here. We have a very safe area. Um, so this Carno is going to do a lot of things for us, guys. Uh, not only is he going to give us the obvious protection, but if we ever get an Allosaurus, for example, at our base, um, obviously we do have the super defensible base that we that we made. Uh, the only problem was, if we did have an Allosaurus here, we couldn't really kill him because he would just be chilling here. The Plant Species X would be shooting at him, but as soon as he walked out of range, he would still be able to just chill. But now, he can not only not get in because of our epic base, but we can take out our Carno over here, and we can go over and we can slay any danger that lurks outside of our base. Um, so actually, let me just check, is he a male? Okay, so he is a male. For some reason, we have, like, all male dinos. Um, so yeah, guys, go ahead and leave me a comment in the comments section if you have an idea of what to name our Carno. It can go ahead and, um... Uh, what's the word? Like, use the theme, I guess, that we have been using for our dino name. So maybe something with a C. Maybe like... What name start with C? Charlie or something? Charlie the Carn... I mean, I don't know. Maybe something that doesn't sound with the... Start with the Cha because the Carno doesn't really... What was that? Lightning? Might be a storm. Um, yeah, maybe something that starts with the, like, hard C, the K. Um, yeah, but anyway... Let's just, let me see real quick, what do we need for a Carno saddle? Let's type that in real quick, C-A-R-N, where is it at? Okay, so what does it take? Okay, fiber, hide, and metal. I'm going to have to go grab some metal. Like I said, we are on a budget. Uh, I do need some more metal. I'll have some smelting up, and I will be right back when we have our Carno all saddled up. Aha, so... We have got all of our metal armor. I did a little bit of resource gathering, a little bit of metal smelting. Actually, if I turn around, can you see the smoke coming out of my house? Maybe? I don't know. I can't really see it. Um, okay. Also, we have made ourselves a Carno saddle, so let's throw that on this bad boy. There we go. Oh my god, he's so loud. I don't know if that's loud for you guys. It's very loud for me. I'm gonna turn down the volume. Okay. Alright. So anyway... We are riding our first Carno, guys. This is absolutely magnificent. Um, he's also our first... What's it called? Carnivore. Wait, actually, I guess Tyranodons are carnivore, but they're they're like lame carnivores, you know? They're like the, the lowest of the low carnivores. This guy, he is... Oh my god, he's so fast. Oh my god, he is... Is this abnormal? Is he like... He's taking like medications or something? Why is he running so fast? He's... Listen to his footsteps. He should not be that fast. Anyway, let's look at upgrades real quick. He got two levels just for chilling. Uh, I guess we'll put him into... Oh my god, he already got like a thousand health points from that. So I figured... Uh, okay, can you... Enough. Enough for your little show. Let's walk. Okay, so I figured we would go kill something big maybe real quick together, and then we could do a little speed taj of me going around and leveling up our Carno. Let's look around real quick. I know this is... Yeah, there's a 130 Bronto. I don't know if we really want to go after something that huge yet. Look at these trikes. Can I see, please? What levels are these guys? That's a 130. Okay. And that's a 45. Let's take out the trikes, actually, I think. Let's do this. Oh, wait, there's another one. Oh, my God. There's going to be a triple trike. <gasps> there's a 150 there. Ooh, we might tame that guy later. I think he might be stuck. So I don't want to hit this Bronto. All right, let's do it. Come on. Here we go. We're going after him. I don't even care. I think this is the 45. Let's see how our guy performs. We're straight murdering. Oh, my God. We're literally murdering these guys. You're done, you're done, you're done. What is with the knockback? What is with the knockback? Get off me. Come on. You know you want to die. The Carno is too strong for you. I'm actually losing a decent amount of health here, guys. But then again, our health is pretty low. Oh, actually, that may have been the health that I lost from leveling up his health. Did I just piss off a Bronto? No, we're good. All right, let's eat some bodies real quick. All right, let's look at the levels. What do we got? We got three levels from that. Uh, let's do a little bit more health. 
There we go. We're already at 6,000 health, so we've got him at halfway down already because of upgrades. So there we have it. Our guy is super powerful. He's going to be amazing for protection, amazing for offense as well. I am going to... Oh, he actually... Oh, right, I remember. He has, like, this little headbutt thing. That's the other button. There's, like, the attack... Can, I, can you not poop while I'm showing them something? There's attack, and then there's like his headbutt thing. So I'm going to take this guy around, guys, see if we can find anything big, and we will do another one of our level up speed tages. I hope you enjoy, and I will see you when we have done it. Alright guys, I'm going to come back if we have anything awesome in our speed Taj. I found a Carno here. This guy has killed me before, and it is time to use his brother to take revenge. Here we go. We're starting with a headbutt. Bang. Let's go. Come on. You're done. You're done. You ain't got nothing. You ain't got nothing on our Carno. Goodbye. Goodbye. Chomp. And you're done. Absolutely done. Okay, guys, I've been going for quite a while. Nothing too interesting. I just saw this. I'm just going to take the chance. I'm going to go for it. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, yes. It's one at a time. Those guys are being dumb. I'm stuck on a rock. No. No. Kill him. Oh, God. He just gave me the chomp. He just gave me the chompski. Okay. We're moving slowly because we're bleeding. Come on. Can we get these guys? Oh, and now this guy's the alpha now. All right. I'm just going in. I'm going in for the kill. What? That guy literally just disappeared out of thin air. What is occurring? And okay, he's gonna teleport behind me or something. No. <laughs> he's just... Okay. So not only can our Carno murder Allosaurus, he can also teleport them off the face of the earth. Oh my god, that is a steep drop. Oh my! Oh! No, no, no! No! Oh god! No, 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 no,
Oh my god. Do I want to fight him? What level is he? Level 55. Oh god, I'm afraid right now. I sort of just want to... Okay, what what kind of health are we at? Oh god, we're at 5,000 health. I'm going to make a really bad decision. Can I even get down here without like taking a ton of damage? Come on, nice and slow. Nice and slow. Here we go. We're entering. We're entering this. Come here. Let's go. We're doing it. Oh, God. Oh, no, no. Oh, God. Can we teleport away like the Allosaurus? Can we teleport out of here? Oh, we don't need to. We're taking this guy. Yeah, let's go. You got nothing. Oh, my God. Slayed. Absolutely slayed. Finally, we have returned, guys. I hope you enjoyed the little speed Taj. Hope you enjoyed our parts where we came back. I almost got mauled by a T-Rex that I did not even know was there. Our Carno has been bumped up to level 245. Let's check out the stats. So, health. We started out with about 4,000 health when he was tamed. He finished out at about 10,000 health, which is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Stamina. Uh, I don't think I did anything to stamina. That's the same. Oxygen and food I would never upgrade. Weight is the same. Melee damage is now at about 560%. I believe we were somewhere in the range of 340 or 360%. So nearly a 200% increase, which is magnificent. And movement speed has not changed. So this guy is now a complete powerhouse. As you saw, I took on another Carno. I took on a pack of Allosaurus. I took on Brontos. I even managed to take out a Rex, who is like more than double his size. So absolutely spectacular carnivore we have here. This guy is going to be perfect for base defense. And like I said, he's also going to be amazing for offense. So he's basically all of our murderous needs can be carried out by this, by this legend in green right here. So really, really cool dino tame for today, guys. Uh, we also got our taming area done. I think I had an idea while I was going around leveling our guy up. I had an idea of what we could call this. I was thinking the taming shack, right? I mean, come on. What is better than the taming shack? This literally is a taming shack. So anyway, um, pretty sick taming shack. Got our ladder, whatever there. Uh, I think that is about it for this episode. I know I mentioned earlier, guys. I'll mention it once again. Uh, please go ahead and leave me any name suggestions down in the comments section. It is really helpful, to, and we can come up with some really funny names together. Uh, but yeah, that is going to be it for this video. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time on Digital Universe.